My dear Chelsea, what happened? I haven't posted about Chelsea for almost a year and it's been a long time and my Chelsea is in the same. And I felt like this is the right time to make the comeback and to express my views on Chelsea and football in general. And Chelsea is going through a tough time and I need to speak my truth and it's time to put away the bullshit and it's time to speak the truth about the club the biggest club in london and the truth is we are not moving like the biggest club in london and the way we lost the final against liverpool was just embarrassing a billion pounds spent and that's how you play against a bunch of academy guys a liverpool team that's just destroyed with injuries that's just unacceptable and listen the thing is the club is ran by stupid people. Simple as that. The directors, mid-table people, like, come on, bro. Like, Brighton, Southampton guys, like, they're not serious. At best, they can just maybe run up some basic parts of the club. But the directors of the football, you got to kick them out, man. Or at least demote them to a different level. Simple as that. The owners, the owners, money spent... They just want yes man in the club, but they don't want actually people who actually got the balls to talk about the reality of the club. And no one actually wants to bring up the truth to them, you know. They just want yes man in the club. They sacked Tuchel for that. It wasn't for tactics and results. It was purely for him speaking his truth. Pochettino doesn't do that. Yes man. The directors, yes man. Simple as that. That's why the club is stuck two years and absolute nothingness. Absolute no, no results, no progress. Just going nowhere. That's the reality. I haven't posted about Chelsea for a long time. But I felt like it's my duty to just talk, you know, share the truth. Because, yeah, the way they're moving, it's not going to end well. There's going to be crazy protests very soon if they, you know, continue losing like this. And it's unacceptable to... Being a state like this, 10, 11, 12 in the Premier League, like, come on, man. Like, under Abramovich, not everything was perfect, but if you were like four, five, like four, six, like the club was just under turmoil, like they had standards. Look at Bayern, look at Real Madrid, look at the way they're moving. Like, anytime the standards drop a little bit, boom, they replace it, they're back to the top. That's how a top club should move. Look at Man City, man. The way they're moving, perfect. Sporting director, properly working with Guardiola, the coaches. They know what they need. But look at Chelsea. Absolute disaster, man. I'm not even going to mention the players because all of them stem from the directors, the owners, from head to head to bottom, you know? Pochettino, all of these guys are responsible. The players are responsible too, don't get me wrong. But... They are there because of the directors. They are there because of the owners. And until the directors don't change, nothing is going to shift. I mean, we can't even change the owners because no one's gonna, really going to buy this club. But they're stuck in this thing for like years. But the directors are the easiest thing to change. Like you have to change the directors. Get like a proper, like smart director of football. And then replace Pochettino. Because this guy is just a Tottenham. You know what I mean? Like we cannot... We cannot go nowhere with this coach, right? So that's my mind. I finally back on this account. I'm going to post more of my thoughts. But yeah, these are my thoughts on Chelsea.